Hello there, I'm excited to share with you the latest updates that we have to Photoshop on the iPad, which I have right in front of me here, but it's weird because I'm in Lightroom. And that's actually where I wanna begin because you can take an asset that you're working on in Lightroom and right up here from this flyout menu, guess what, this isn't an export, it's a round trip. Edit in Photoshop. So jump out of Lightroom, open this up in Photoshop on the iPad, make the changes that you want. Bear with me a moment. There it is. We can see that I can use uh, a fairly new feature, select subject, you know, do all those fun things that you want to do in Photoshop. In fact, I'm going to take it to the next level because I want to add right in here a clipping mask and it's going to be curves, which is brand new in Photoshop on the iPad. I'm just tweaking curves for that bare layer, as you can see right there. In fact, let's just make sure that's set to lighten. I think that looks pretty good. I could play with this some more if I want. Just a quick double exposure example that you can really only do in Photoshop, yet you can jump back into Lightroom and continue to work on it there, as you can see right down here. It even says, hey, receiving document. Hey, open it up. There it is. So super fun what you can do uh, working between Lightroom and Photoshop. And thanks so much for watching.